Happy Information Wednesday, Shalise McQueen here of the Shalise McQueen Agency out of Scottsdale, Arizona. Last week I brought you um, a bulletin on Arizona legislation, did pass a new um, auto requirement which increased the liability limits from 15, 30, 15 to 25, 50, 25, which again still is basically no coverage considering what accidents cost these days. But that did go in fact last week, July 1st. So I thought on in the honor of liability limits, I think it'd be important to also touch on an issue that we have here, and that is uninsured and underinsured drivers and what that coverage means on your auto policy. I've had customers, I've audited their accounts that I inherited that didn't have this coverage, and I approached them asking why, and they said they never were explained really what it's about or why they need it. I've also had customers that were shopping other providers looking for a quote, and they didn't have this coverage either. And I find that just very peculiar understanding here we're in Arizona, we are next to a border, we are a border state, and we have just a ton of drivers that, you know, either don't have any insurance whatsoever that are on our roads, or that have what we call under insurance or underinsured. And so for example, even at 2550, which the new state requirements are, I mentioned a couple of weeks ago that whiplash alone is an award of 18 to like $26,000. You know, cars are built so expensively these days that even the minor, the minor little fender bender with all the sensors on the, the bumper costs, you know, several thousands of dollars. So it is important that we have coverage. And the kicker is if we were to have an auto accident, or as I was saying, if you were to have a run-in with one of these drivers, even though that you have coverage for bodily injury, you have property damage, and of course you have collision and comprehensive coverage, what happens is the other insurance, we have no one to, in essence, subrogate against because it was someone else's fault. And that could leave you in a position where you're going to have to pay out of pocket to fix your car for your medical expenses, etc., because they have no insurance. And let me guess, you're thinking, well, that doesn't make much sense, Shalise, or that's not fair. And I agree with you. It's, it's really unfortunate. And, and in Arizona here, our auto rates are rather expensive because we are you and I are paying for these drivers that don't have insurance, and even the ones that are underinsured. And again, Arizona is trying to make their, their way to higher rates to make sure that auto accidents are being taken care of and medical expenses are being paid for. But the reality, there is such a big deficit. And so it's really important that you do have this coverage on your policy, otherwise you could be left in a situation where you're not gonna have coverage and have to pay out of pocket for somebody else's mistake. So in light of today's conversation, I think it's a great opportunity for you to take some time and audit your personal auto policy, you know, check out what your limits are, your bodily injury, your property damage. Do you even have medical on there? Do you need medical? And we'll cover that in a later episode and go into details of what that looks like and how your health insurance kind of ties into an auto accident. But for today's purpose, make sure you do have uninsured and underinsured coverage on your on your policy because you really cannot afford not to have it based on everything I've given you guys today. And if I could ever be any assistance, I'm happy to review your policy with you, give you a quote. Any way that I can, please feel free to let me know. Call me at 602-525-5665 or email me at cmcqueen at farmersagent.com. As always, thanks for tuning in and we'll see you guys next week.